Hello everybody, my name is Daisy. Welcome back to my Q&A. This is actually the first time I've done a extremely organized one of these. Usually people just ask me questions and I answer them, but I guess that's literally the point of this recording, isn't it? Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what kind of questions you have for me. Why do you keep looking at me through my bedroom window? Why aren't you closing your curtains? Hey Daisy! Hello! So, hypothetically speaking, if I were in need of help getting rid of a large object, how would you say I should go about that? Well, I'm glad you asked. I actually just want to... You just want to go ahead and give this call a number and tell them D sent you. Okay? You'll be just fine. Don't panic. Next question. Hey, Daisy. Hey. What's it like having to pretend this is GB's channel all the time? Oh no. If I had a channel, it would be much more, much more successful than this. Don't insult me. Dear Daisy. Oh, it's like I'm a little self-help column. What's the quickest, most effective way to assure you'll be hired somewhere? Well, I would say to be sure that you have a relevant degree or certificate of training from whatever you think fits the position best, um, you really want to impress them, so do not skimp on the printer paper. They will be able to tell it's fake. So do your homework and don't get caught. Good luck with your job. So you're Daisy, huh? So you're Tom Lee, huh? Hmm. Let's see your resume first, then we'll talk. You think I could fit my resume onto one sheet of paper? You are sadly mistaken, sir. Daisy, who would you pick to play you in the movie of your life? Definitely not writing one about myself already. You don't need to write a movie about yourself. If a movie is going to be made of you, someone else is going to write it. Um, I would say Audrey Hepburn, but you can't, so nobody. Hey, Daisy. Hey. What are your thoughts on GB ASMR, and what is your best impression of her? Also, where are you ticklish? Crying laughing face emoji. Oh. Uh, She's a little, uh, she holds me back quite a bit. Uh, she, <clears throat> Daisy, you can't just go around and do things. The world doesn't work that way. Okay, I think it does. Okay, I beg to differ. GB. Also, about the ticklish question, you're gonna have to pay me for that one because I don't work for free. Daisy, that's me. You've had so many jobs. Do you have any interview tips? Hmm. I would say you want the interviewer to not want to continue to live without you in their life. You know, you have to learn how to read the room and how to make that a reality. That's how I get all my jobs. Pretty easy. Hey Daisy. Hello. What ASMR gang are you a part of? I am perfectly split down the A gang and the R gang. So I am making my own gang, which is the D gang. Only the best may enter. Are you an elf like mistletoe, miss cover my ears with headphones all the time? Rude, first of all. Um, no, I am not an elf. If you know mistletoe, then you should know that I am nothing like her. And I would never and have never let anybody see my ears. I left before they were done, so 
they're gonna stay covered from now on. When you summon Satan, what brand of cereal do you use? Uh, Rice Krispies. Easy, could have just Googled that. If you were ever in a movie, would you be the leading actress? Yes. Also, have you ever ridden a motorcycle? If so, was there any specific reason? Like, with no hands, blindfolded, across the continents, with four people on at the same time? Yes, yes. What is the most efficient way for a normal human being to create a nuclear reactor for potential world domination, hypothetically? Um, you would have to try not being normal first. Daisy, that's me. What's your favorite holiday? Ooh, the purge. What state prison is your favorite? Well, I used to be a warden for a prison down in uh, Central California, and I don't really believe in prisons. If you're smart, you, you shouldn't either. How do you make your hair look so good? Love you, Daisy. I love you too, Erin. Oh, baby, I wake up like this. Thank you. Hey, Daisy. Hey. Got any tips for getting organized? Also, current favorite song. Um, I don't really have a current favorite, but in terms of the organizing, I would say you should have less stuff. Is your hair naturally blue? Yes, I chose it. Is being a world-renowned criminal your life goal, or do you just have bad luck? Oh, okay, sweetie. Different people have different definitions of the word crime. Am I a criminal? Or am I a hero? Am I a cockroach? Or am I a goddess? I have been called all of those things. Depends on who you ask. If you and Chibi are sisters, why do you have a southern accent and Chibi does not? Uh, we're not sisters. And I don't really think you know how accents work. Do you listen to K-pop? You should try putting in an application to become a K-pop idol. You know, um, been there, done that. It really isn't all it's cracked up to be, to be honest. Do you keep a diary? If so, what can you share from it? Okay, I would never write anything down. That is how you get caught. It is all, all up here all up here, baby. Is GB making you do this Q&A against your will? Blink once for yes. You said that you were married three times. Please elaborate. Ah, uh, yes. That was the year that I thought that I would be domesticated. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. Daisy, why do women intimidate me? Probably because you don't treat them like people. What's your favorite drink? Oh, I used to order this drink called Jesus Can't Hit a Curveball. It was enlightening, and it gave me my daily dose of vegetables in every single drink. Highly recommend. How are babies made? Well, when you and this is actually and the goes, the girl goes, and then after the baby. And that's exactly why they tell you 
And there you go. I hope that helped. Daisy. Yes, hello. Where did you run to after the bunker fiasco? I'm in Canada. It's quite nice here. Why do you only wear black lipstick? People miss what I'm saying less. And I don't like to repeat myself. Oh, last question I have here. When is your birthday? I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. Well, those are all the questions that I have time for. Honestly, I am exhausted. I'm going to need to go refresh myself with some treats and maybe a movie, a little foot massage. So thank you all for all your questions you gave me. I hope you learned a little something about me and maybe you can apply these um, very lovely bits of advice I gave you to your own life. I do have to get to my next job interview though, so I'm gonna run, but it was so lovely recording this for you, and I hope to see you soon. Mwah.